We're here with Dorian Barnes, head coach of the CU Women's Club soccer team, following their 2-1 loss to CSU. Coach, general thoughts on the game real quick. Our girls played hard. Um, you know, it's our second game of the season. Um, you know, coming into a venue like this and playing an arch rival, there was a lot of emotion behind the game, uh, a, a, lot of, um, a lot of nerves probably played part of the fact. Um, but in the second half, we, uh, we calmed down a little bit. We started playing the way I know we know how to play. We, we, I think we controlled a lot of the play. Um, we, we, we got a very nice goal from Tara Kistler. And uh, you know, we felt for the last 30, 35 minutes, we had an opportunity to come back. It just didn't come in for us. You guys had a lot of shots going in, or a lot of opportunities at the end of that game. Mm -hmm. uh, do you feel you needed to capitalize a little bit more? <laughs> You know, we, 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 at halftime we discussed, you know, making sure we did get on the end of those kind of balls. And, you know, we, we had a lot of dangerous passes, a lot of dangerous balls, and we had to make sure we got on the end of those and we just uh, just weren't able to do it. CSU made some nice adjustments. They, they, they felt the pressure coming. They adjusted. They got some players going into the back. And, you know, we try to adjust and put more players higher. It just uh, sometimes it just doesn't work out that way. And, but there was something we did discuss, though. I mean, a lot of substitutions throughout the game. Is there any kind of strategy, especially early and late in both halves? Um, you know... This is the second game of the season, um, and during this time, usually I do like to see a lot of players playing. You know, and regardless of the venue and who are playing, we're going to be seeing CSU three more times this year, possibly a fourth time. Um, the, the, the subbing pattern was, you know, we want to get everybody an opportunity out there in a high-level game because we might need them in a high-level game at some point. Um, as the game wore on in the second half, and we definitely needed to get a result. Um, you know, certain players were stepping up, and we, you know, we made adjustments according to that. You know, we tried to throw more speedy, more technical, fast players, players that can finish up top. Took some players out of the back and try to play more direct so you know the second half was definitely a strategy type stuff tactical first half we were just getting some players on the field to get some touches you had a couple of the injuries how did those affect your overall strategy um well one was one was one did hurt us a little bit was abby sullivan she's a senior center back for us um it wasn't anything serious thank goodness it wasn't a, it was a knee injury but from what i hear it was just a, um, an lcl not an acl so hopefully she'll be back soon um the other injury was alicia rosati and um, that was just an ankle problem that she's been having that's kind of been bugging her all season, but she could have gone back in if we needed her to. So um, strategy-wise, you know, Abby did hurt a little bit. We would like to have used her to help uh, relieve some of our backs, but we have to play it without them sometimes. Oh, last question. That physical play, especially in the second half, do you think that's going to help you guys going down throughout the rest of the season? Absolutely. You know, when you go to the national tournament, we're also going to Santa Barbara. Um, you know, the top level teams in the country, the highest level teams in the country, they play physical. That's the way the game is played. Um, you know, it's not un, you know it's not cheap or you know illegal. It's just hard, hard fought, hard working players and players tackling and trying to win balls and trying to do everything they can to win the game. And you know. It, Anytime we can get that in our own league, in our own state, which, you know, we don't see that too often here. We need to get, we need to take advantage of that and learn from it. So, yeah, it was absolutely a huge benefit. Thank you, Coach. Thank you. You're welcome.